Hello, everyone, and welcome to Dragon Ball Z League off-season event. No, not off-season event. Mid-season event of Goldo's... <laughs> Goldo's Gardening Adventure. I'm Ryan. And I'm Jay. So, uh, you know, just a little quick rundown uh, due to um, Frieza Soldier's unfortunate passing. Still, uh, still very upset about that. Um... You know, we need a new event. And so Goldo, who has uh, been riding the bench of Namek this year. No, that's Bobbity. Goldo, who's currently not in the league because he's taking some time to uh, master his horticulture, uh, has raised some Cybermen from some remnants he found when Nappa and Vegeta originally attacked planet Earth and brought them to Namek. And so basically... Yeah, every team has one character. They're going to fight uh, Goldo and two Cybermen, and the Cybermen are Le Crime de la Crap, and Goldo is also the ultimate warrior. I, I love the little, like, you know, the 40, 50-year-old woman sort of, like, signs <laughs> that they end up having. Live, laugh, freeze. <laughs> yeah, live, laugh, freeze. Favorite, live, laugh, freeze. Gardening is much cheaper than therapy, and you get sensu beans. I don't need a garbage See, disposal I when I have one. four explosives. Hold on. He says here, four explosive kids. Shouldn't there be four Cybermen? Staff? <laughs> the other two are, are in college. Oh. They moved out. Damn. That's why she, that she's been uh, pouring wine down her throat if she ever gets decapitated. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so it's... Kids are out. Wine comes out to play. Yeah. Uh, so this event is nothing super serious. No win losses um, that will affect the main season. It's just something in the middle of the season that we're doing to give a little bit of alleviation and just a lo fun little thing to be like, hey, let's see what happens. You know. <laughs> but first... Yeah, just, uh, just have a little bit of fun. Yeah. So the first match is uh, Androids with Android 17. I, we don't have cards for it, so. <laughs> Android 17 should be the one to do it because, as we all know, in Super, he becomes, uh, what was that, a preservationist garden gardener? I don't yeah, know exactly. He, uh, but the he's animals, used to working he's a with, park ranger. Yes, he's used to working with nature, so this should be no problem for him. He's rocking Super Plus 2, Key Minus 1, High Tension, Indignation, Hatred of Saiyans, Fighting Spirit, and Shouts of AI. Yeah, so um, each, and the Cybermen has, uh, what exactly? Uh, Cybermen builds are, uh, sorry, are they on the build dock or no? Uh, I guess not, but the or Cybermen, they, Cybermen have before, Ultra yeah. Divine Water. So uh, Ultra Divine Water gives them a plus one to every stat, but takes away 10,000 of their health. Um, yeah. Makes sense. Uh, yeah, it looks like... Both Cybermen just have Ultra Divine Water, and Goldo has Ultimate Warrior 1. Yes. Ooh, the Acid. That's a very smart move by the Cybermen. And 17, with no healing, has already taken half of his health against one Cyberman. Yeah, I don't think this is going to end well for him. He really needs to start picking up the pace here, start throwing out some more B2s. Uh, and start getting that burst damage. I would love if he could take out Cyberman. Ooh, I was going to say, without using a B2 here, save it for the next one. He doesn't do that. Well, that's three bars down. He has seven more to go. Yep. Uh, ooh. Misses that B2, which is good for 17. Uh, his charge rate is just outstanding. Yeah, because he has the high tension and hatred of Saiyans, which... They stack, and Hatred of Saiyans is basically a tension one, tension up one, compared yeah. to high tension, and so uh, he has like a, he gets a bar like probably every 15 to, 10 to 15 seconds. Okay, people are also asking about the music, I'm, I'm not sure if that's oh. going, but. Um... Uh, you know what, we will have music for the next match, because I completely forgot about music. Um, I don't think 17 is going to be able to completely sweep Goldo. He might be able to nope. make it. Nope. <laughs> so, uh, okay, five bars. <laughs> Thank you, 17. So, chat had voted. It ended so quickly that we didn't get to read. Chat voted 50% said two KOs. Very close to that. 
yes, he was indeed very close to that. Let me uh, let me reorganize just a few things here, um, and I will be able to get us into a proper situation and just get right into the next match. Uh, I should I should ask the question: Is this going to be two episodes or four episodes this week, staff? I have to assume four episodes, right? Four episodes of four matches? I would assume four episodes as well, but I just want to make sure. Okay, cool. On to match number two, uh, we have, if I can actually load the thing, Budokai with Android 18. So, Android 18 is rocking Key Plus 2, Super Minus 1, Indignation, High Tension, Hatred of Saiyans as well, Master Blast, and TNAI. So during the practice matches that uh, we do before um, we start streaming, I grabbed her for uh, just to see like what her charge rate is on this build, and it's nuts. Really? Yeah, it's nuts. Yeah, I mean, looking at it there, it is pretty good. And the fact that they're just passive chargers makes it so scary. Mm -hmm. it, it's now, going uh, to be interesting to see if she can do better than her brother. Yeah. Destructo Disc, there we go, a little bit of damage. Both are rocking a similar idea of just hitting B2. So the real question is, will she spam? Yes. And, like, her being in the water is not going to be that big of a detriment to her either, because, like, yeah, her, her T-charge is just way too great. Are these the only two androids that are in? I'm, I'm not sure who Red uh, If Baby counts as an android, I think Baby's in. I just meant, like, the passive chargers who won't, like, be... Her I'm pretty sure these are the only two, yeah. No, uh, neither. Oh, okay. <laughs> I figured it was going to be one of the two. Oh, Infinity Bullet. No, oh, but she's not doing that well either. Like, she's already taken two bars against Cybermen. Yeah. Oops, super Unyielding Spirit. Oh, wow. wastes a Sadistic 18. Well, well it, it gets it her. Yeah, it gets her an elimination, but that's still kind of rough. Yeah. I don't think that was a great use, personally. But if it gets a kill, it gets a kill. Yeah, and like, look at that. That's with the charge penalty, and she got a bar in like five seconds. Yeah, I I think that she might be able to take this, but she's really got to start spamming. Like I said earlier, then I guess connecting, but that's her fourth B2, which is good, but she is on her last bar. High speed rush. I don't think she's going to win this. Nope. So chat has voted 40%, sorry, 47% said two KOs, 35% said one KO, and 17% said full sweep. So well, not a lot of believers in chat. No, and it looks like uh, three and a half bars was what the damage was there. Wow, and another finish to uh, that full power energy wave. You gotta remember, this is the cream of the crop for Goldo. Like, Goldo's very proud Literally. of what he's done, like, in his free time. He's really gotten in touch with himself uh, and has made some beautiful vegetables. But now we have Evil Boo. <laughs> Evil Boo, we're flying through these. Evil Boo might last a little bit longer due to his build, which is defense plus two, eternal life, latent energy, and Shoutsu AI. See if he can stall out the Cybermen a little bit. Yeah, uh... We're going to have a lot of these Eternal Life users, and they probably have the best chance. Yeah. Because uh, right now, nobody we've seen had any sort of healing, so any damage they took stuck. Uh, I hope healing helps, because it, it makes sense on paper. Mm -hmm. The more characters you have to get through, you just want to last, so... Yeah. If you have healing, it'll just make you last longer. Spo spoiler alert for later in my match. We thought uh, healing was banned for this event, so we didn't bother putting healing on. <laughs> Ooh. Hey, <gasps> that's fine. I mean, more points to attack, I suppose. Possibly, yeah. Oh, the health pushback. That doesn't help. And... Oh, oh! That combination right there just did not help Evil Boo out at all. 
call in Lemony you snick it because that was a series of unfortunate events. <laughs> <laughs> nice reference. <laughs> Thank you. Appreciate it. Um, Evil Boo not doing too hot right now. I mean, I think maybe marginally better than the androids, but not by much. Oh, he gets androids, acid, I mean, dude. Oh, if only they had exquisite skill. Yeah, that would that would be interesting. Wow. See, Evil Boo would love a, a breath. Uh, what is it called? Mystic breath on this one, or is it? Um, yeah, flame shower flame breath. Shower breath. Another yes. acid. Wow, good hit by Cyberman. Jeez, he's just not letting up. Evil Boo just really hasn't done much. Yeah, and yeah, the Cyberman bomb was not going to happen there. But oh, Kaiko Sen. Okay. That's there an ult. That's a useful uh, time for the ult, and he's faring better than both 17 and 18 did. Yeah, I um, I think that this is a pretty good start, especially with the healing. <laughs> Uh, if he can just stall now, it, it's looking better. And honestly, I think he might be able to take out the second Cyberman. Yeah, uh, in, in terms of like uh, progression for what we saw, um, I definitely think like he can get through the second Cyberman as to whether or not he'll get through Goldo at the current rate. Yeah, so uh, both Cybermen only have Ultra Divine Water on them. And Goldo has Ultimate Warrior 1, I believe. Yeah. And we'll talk more about Goldo's build if we ever see Goldo. Yeah. But right now, Ultra Divine Water, I think, gives you a plus one to everything and a minus one bar. Yeah. Plus one to your main four stats and a minus one health bar. Uh, yeah. So doesn't. It's not like they're just going out without a build or anything. Yeah. Kaiko said, oh, the after image. This second Cyberman has been a menace for everyone so far. Seriously, I don't know. Yeah, apparently, Cyberman 2 is just way stronger. I wanted uh, to make way, him red, but I wasn't allowed to. <laughs> predictions are in. Two KOs, 52%. One KO, 26%. And a full sweep, 21% of viewers think. It looks like he might be able to take the second KO here. Possibly, yeah. Getting close. I mean, Cyberman does have the ability. He's at a good health range if he goes to max power to do the bomb. Yeah. God, that would be so much fun. All right, let's see. Oh, just a little bit more. Well, health. no, I mean, the ping pong, like, the ping pong might do it. Yeah, it might. Oh, nope. Okay. <laughs> it gets the acid. Oh, Man. so Five and a half bars there for Evil Boo. Second Cyberman just showing he's a menace. <laughs> I, who thought Second Cyberman would be the MVP of this event? <laughs> All right. The final match for this episode is Cinema with Fasha. Fasha, Rocket Defense plus two, Dende's Healing, Combo Master, Laden Energy, Quick Fast Attack, a Broly's Ring, and Goku AI. We saw last time that Eternal Life did help. I don't know how much it helped. Obviously, we don't have the stats on that. But, um, yeah, it's not looking... It's not looking great. Yeah, I think Cooler is currently at the highest level right now. Like, he Ooh. just... He, he just... Or, sorry, not Cooler. Boo just eked out 17 so yes he did 5.55 it seems android 17 did 5.1 so right now evil boot is our champ we'll see if he stays there all right let's see fascia is starting a great start yeah already done a bar and a half hasn't taken a bar yet so that's really good for her Look at that Probably, combo. I, I, that's got to be the best start we've had so far. And it, she's pretty dominant right now, which is good to see. Yeah, I think both other... Um, or all the other starts that we've had... Uh-oh. Um, Cyberman on one bar with um, max power mode. Okay, never oh. mind. I was going to say, that too... could have been very scary. Yes, does a good chunk of damage still. Oh, but... They are really using um, that acid well. Well, okay, she couldn't even get past the first one without taking half health, even with that great of a start. Uh, she just couldn't close. 
Cyberman 1 tired of his younger brother taking the spotlight. <laughs> yeah. And remember, they could tag, correct? They tagging are a yeah, tagging anything. tagging is an option, so like there could be matches where nobody goes down. Yeah, well let's see. We got uh one elimination so far in energy ballet. <laughs> uh oh Are she No, yeah. yeah, she canceled out the full power energy wave right before it was gonna hit her. Ooh, nice full power. Will we see hysteric Saiyan lady? I assume not. I would I would hope so, because that would really help her right now. Ooh, that health pushback Ooh. helps her. I think a lot of people voted after they saw that start. Uh, full sweep at 42%, two KOs at 38%, one KO at 19% from the chat. Yeah, I mean, she does have eternal life, right? Or does she have Dende's? No, she has Dende's. She has Dende's, so I mean, she does have the healing factor. It could definitely help her out. Saying Soul, I think, gets her power body for a bit. Yep. Yeah. She is also one of the previous winners of sweepers, so that definitely could be a factor as well. Will she be the first to take out two? She does. There we go. All right, two so KOs, the first one, the new leader. Goldo Ultimate Warrior One. What does that do again? I am oh. not positive. Ooh, she hit. That's a really good hit. Lead. All stats are up, uh, with no downsides. Is it a plus one or a plus four? Ooh. Well, I, I think it's just Ultra Divine Water without the health, if I ah. remember correctly. Okay, so all stats are uh, then just plus one without the health loss. Uh, Ultimate Warrior 4 now gives a plus four. So this being Ultimate Warrior 1 gives a plus one. Okay. But uh, Fasha has it within a bar. Yeah. Fasha is staying in here. She did a great start against Goldo. I... I think she might be able to do it if she can get off her second ultimate. But yeah, as Goldo long as he doesn't. Oh. Uh oh. Oh, oh. oh very Ooh. close. Six, seven, eight. Eight and like three quarters of a bar for her. Uh, clearly the uh, like uh, the winner right the now. Leader? Like yeah, the, the leader. leader. Uh, but no, uh, the Cybermen and Goldo have become uh, are so far undefeated. Um, you have the, do you have the spreadsheet info? Up? I do, yes. yes. So, Android 17 had 1 KO with 5.1 bars of damage remaining, or sorry, 5.1 bars of damage done. Android 18 had 1 KO with 3.5 bars of damage done. Evil Boo had 1 KO with 5.55 bars of damage done. And Fasha had 2 KOs with 8.75 bars of damage done and these are out of 10 mind you so she was the only one who got significantly past halfway so far yeah uh and so we have 12 more of these matches so make sure to do your usual youtube thing of liking subscribing ringing the bell check out the links in the description for our website our discord our tiktok our twitter and any other links that we may end up having down there to help support the league you can end up declaring for a team and help them build characters for fun events like this or even the main season until tomorrow's episode i'm ryan and i'm jay and we will see you then